Good afternoon, my viewers, and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Maria, your spiritual guide. In today's video, I want to teach you how to use an onion. Yes, how to use this onion to manifest different things. How to use an onion to pray for different things. Do you have dreams? Do you want to own a car? Do you want to have a house? Do you want to have a good life? Do you know that you have the power to pray for yourself? Do you know that you have the vibration to stand in your faith and proclaim victory in your life? Do you know that your Father in heaven is the one who owns the silver and gold? Yes, and you as their children, as his children, you must be okay. You must be able to get all your heart's desires. You must be able to live according to God's plan. If silver and, belong, and gold belong to God, you might not be the richest in the world, but you must have all the basic needs of life. Yes, you can use just a piece of onion to manifest whatever you want in your life. And trust me, by the special grace of God, everything will change by and by. You can do it once a month. You can do it once a year. You can do it any time you want or you feel like, yes? But when you do this, your life will change for better and better. Sorry about that. Before I go into the full video, I want to encourage everyone who's visiting me for the first time, subscribe, share, like, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that each time I upload a new video, you can be notified. Now back to my video. You can use just a piece of onion to change your life. Yes, you don't need to, 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 to do any blood ritual. You don't need to go to a witch doctor. You don't need to evoke any spirits. You can use this with the power of prayer to change your life. God put behind powers in many things in our environment that we can use with prayer to manifest things we want. All you will need is you get your onion like this. You don't need to remove any skin from it. Eh? Just get an onion. After getting an onion, before you go to sleep, hold it and pray. Of course, you're not praying to the onion. You're just holding the onion and praying to your God in heaven. It doesn't matter what religion you are. What matters is you have the faith, even if it is small as a mountain. Hold your onion and you pray. Pray according to your faith. In the mighty name of God, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Allah. Pray for all your dreams to come true. Pray for God to manifest those good things you want in your life. Don't pray to just live. Are you diseased? Do you have any problems? Sorry, my video has been interrupted. I don't even know where I stopped. But what I was saying, you can pray using an onion for any issue. Is it a health issue? Are you paralyzed? Do you have stroke? Do you have an evil disease? Pray while holding this onion and put this onion under your bed. Pray against any roaming spirits in your household. Pray against any genes in your household. Pray against any evil diseases in your household. Pray against any evil birds, any evil insects, any evil houseflies, any evil cockroaches, any evil rats, any evil well geckos. And the surveillance spirits, eh? pray that they be neutralized in the mighty name of God. Pray to, for your dreams to come true. Pray for you to get a marital partner. Pray to drive your dream car. Pray to secure that bicycle you want. Pray to secure that motorcycle you want. Pray to get that piece of land you want. Pray to get that... That to, to finalize that housing project you have, that building project. Pray to secure that contract. Pray to get that visa, to get that contract. Yes, God has given you dominion over everything. You can pray for yourself. You can change your life. You can deliver yourself using the word of God, using the power of God, through praying in God's name, in Allah's name, in Jesus' name, depending on where you belong to. Yes, do that. After praying, put this onion on a plate and just put it under the bed. Yes, if you know how to pray and you've been praying and you've not been getting answers, 
this is a time for you to start seeing, to get answers for your prayers. Yes. But of course, I always encourage you, don't try out these things before you cleanse. Yes. Those people who try out them and these things work, those are spiritually clean people. With spiritually clean people, when they, when they do these spiritual practical things, sometimes they work instantly. Other times they work. But there are people who try out these things and they will never work for them. That means you're spiritually unclean. Take a spiritual cleansing bath. If you're on my TikTok, look very well on my profile. There is that icon for YouTube. When you click on it, it will take you direct to my YouTube. Subscribe, click videos, click popular. You'll check out that cleansing video. Then you cleanse yourself. After cleansing yourself, then start to try out all these simple remedies. And by the special grace of God, you'll be okay. Those who are, who are lazy in doing some of these spiritual things, if you're lazy, if you're a lazy person, or you find it hard to do all these things, order for my soap and brown salt. These two things like, like, work like fire. They have helped so many people. I cannot tell how many. They have helped so many people. I can send them anywhere at the comfort of your home in this place. Anywhere. If you're outside Uganda, I can send them via DHL. Yes, if you're within Uganda, I can send via. Yes, wherever you are, you can receive these things. If you're within Uganda, we can send by bus, taxi, border, depending on your location. But all delivery costs are at yours. Eh? Like they are, you meet all the expenses. When once you make the payment, I can be able to send you the usage instructions. Trust me, within two weeks you start to see changes. These things like work like fire. Tried, tested, trusted. Yes, I have so many people who have testimonies on these things. Try them. See you in my next video. Goodbye. I love you all.